so this is gonna be something a little bit new. Never done this before, so bear with me as I go through this. But my name's Rihanna. I'm an archaeologist by trade, um, and I just kind of want to play Uncharted and kind of go through it. I've definitely played this series before, uh, but that was when I was my undergrad or going through grad school, or actually just an undergrad. I don't think uh, did a game come out when I was in grad school. Probably. Anyway. Um, anyway, now. <laughs> I'm gonna have to edit this somehow. Um, now that I've got uh, the degrees under my belt and kind of a little bit more trained in archaeology than I was in undergrad, I just kind of wanted to replay these, uh, have a little bit of fun, give a little insight, see what I can see about how archaeology is portrayed within the Uncharted series because uh, it's definitely a series that I love. It's got the tinges of Indiana Jones, it's got the really nice Nathan Fillion-esque anti-hero and Nathan Drake that I thoroughly enjoy out of any type of character in a story. Uh, the humor is fantastic. I'm interested and intrigued in seeing the movie that's supposed to come out soon. So we'll we'll see, but we'll get started with the first one. Brand fucking new. Continuous speedrun. What the fuck? Um, I'm gonna do normal because I'm bad at the game. But oh no. But if anyone has not played Uncharted, or you're watching this uh, because you're interested in how an archaeologist perceives Uncharted, uh, I'm going to try and be very introductory to both. Uh, we're going to basically act like we're fresh in all of this. I do not have a big background in any of the stories discussed in either any of these games. Uh, my focus is mostly on southeastern prehistory. I guess I'm definitely one of I'm here Huddles off the coast of Panama where we just recovered what we believe to be the coffin of legendary explorer Sir Francis Drake, who was buried at sea over 400 years ago. Are you sure you want to be defiling your ancestors' remains like that? You make it sound so dirty. <laughs> Besides, I thought you didn't believe me. Well, I did do my research, and apparently Francis Drake didn't have any children. Well, history can't be wrong, you know. That it can. Written history can be wrong. For example, you can't defile an empty coffin. What the hell? Also 100% looting right now. There's so much cool archaeology that could have been done in finding a fucking coffin. <laughs> you devil. What is it? Come on, hold it up. Oh, no, 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 no way. Deal was for a coffin. That's it. Wait a minute. If my show hadn't have funded this expedition, hey, hey, you wouldn't have... You got your story, lady. Look, Mr. Drake, you signed a contract. <laughs> I have a right to see no, every single thing that... Could you hold that thought? Sully? Uh, we got some trouble. Hurry it up. Okay, okay. What's going on? Uh, pirates. Pirates? Yeah, the modern kind. They don't take prisoners. At least not male prisoners. Wait, what are you talking about? Uh, sh shouldn't we call the authorities or something? Uh, that'd be a great idea, but we don't exactly have a permit to be here. What? Yeah, so unless you want to end up in a Panamanian jail... We should probably handle this ourselves. But well, what's worse? You obviously haven't been in a Panamanian jail. Do you know how to use one of these? Uh, yeah, it's like a camera. You just you point and shoot, right? Good girl. Here we go. <sighs> how the hell they find us out here? Oh my god, it's been so long since I played. Thought I lost. Oh you my god. Off? Uh, it's kind of a long story. These guys don't like you much, do they? Less talking, more shooting. Oh, let me just fucking jump everywhere first. Hurry up, Sully. Where even is he? Just press 
five squares in a row for a furious combo. <laughs> Just jam all the buttons. Assist is fucking weird. Oh, probably shouldn't shoot you. control until they blew up the boat. <laughs> you all right? Nothing the years of therapy won't fix. Well, if it isn't the beautiful and talented Elena Fisher. Flattery will get you screen time. Yeah, I'm more of a behind-the-scenes kind of guy. Victor Sullivan. Oh. <laughs> uh, for Christ's sakes. <sighs> what do you say we get out of here? before we attract any more attention. Well? A little present from Sir Francis. Oh, oh, so you found the coffin. Wait a minute, is this what I think it is? <laughs> Drake's lost diary. He faked his death, just like I said, Sully. He must have been onto something big. Yeah, well, let's just keep that between us. Thanks for the loan, Mr. Drake. I think I've earned a look at that diary when we land. So yeah, Nathan Drake kind of represents the worst fear for archaeologists. So, uh, <laughs> when Drake sailed into the Pacific, he took the Spanish fleet completely by surprise. He captured their ships, he took all their maps, their letters, their journals, and he recorded everything in this diary. Uh-huh, so this... But, when he got back to England, Queen Elizabeth confiscated all of his charts and logbooks, including this one, and then swore his entire crew to silence. Yeah, so this... You see, Drake discovered something on that voyage, Sully. Something so secret and so valuable, they couldn't risk it getting out. All right, Nate, just pretend for a minute that I don't really care about any of that stuff and cut to the chase, would you? <sighs> Man only interested in the climax. He must be a real hit with the ladies. Never had any complaints. Okay, then. I'll jump to the good part, just for you. Ho, ho, ho. Huh? El goddamn Dorado. He was onto something big, all right. Does it say anything else? Oh, so now you're interested, huh? Yeah. Well, unfortunately, no. Last page was torn out. I'm telling you, Sully. This is it. This is finally it. Yeah. Only... We got one little problem. Yes, that's what I said. It blew up. It sank. No, that's why we have insurance, right? Oh. Oh no, the camera? No, the camera's fine. Don't worry about the camera, no. Still as good as new. Sully, the girl can hold her own. You should have seen her. Fine. 
You go on out there and you tell her, we just found the lost city of gold. Maybe her producer can get it on the air tonight. Oh, come on. Nate, do you trust me? More or less. Good. Because we're going to have every two-bit scumbag in the world racing us to this treasure unless we cut her loose right now. You're a real gentleman, Sully. I know. It stinks. She'll get over it. No, I don't... I don't care for over budget. I mean, do you realize that this could be, like, the biggest story of the year? <laughs> Hi. No, I don't trust him, okay? That's why we need to move fast. So just get me the camera crew, and I promise you that... Son of a bitch. Hey! <sighs> Should have seen that one coming. Ugh. I'm not as young as I used to be. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you weren't too old for that little barmaid in Lima, were you? <laughs> well, that was different. Although I must admit, equally as strenuous. <laughs> well, hang in there, old timer. We're just about there. <laughs> you know, this reminds me. I ever tell you about the time I pawned a phony 16th century Santo off on Pablo Escobar? <laughs> uh, risky move, but by the time he figured it out, I was... Nate, are you even listening to me? <laughs> Hanging on every word. Uh, why waste my breath? I'm actually gonna look this up. Um, how old this game is. Not Overwatch, Uncharted. Two thousand and seven, holy crap. I remember this game was I mean it's still very beautiful. I remember how realistic I thought that it was when this one first came out. I mean I feel like every new game is like that. Yeah, as I was saying earlier before, uh, so they were... You really think Francis Drake came all the way up here, huh? We're an awful long way from England. Me. They were all <laughs> illegally digging up underneath the ocean without a permit, as was mentioned. Uh, so for archaeologists, that's super troublesome, because now something as super important as potentially Sir Francis Drake's coffin has been looted up with no one taking any notes or anything so we don't know where it was found where it was located what else could be in that vicinity because they just dug it up took everything out well, from it didn't tell nobody so it's just lost forever it. no one's ever gonna know according to this we're right on top of the mark maybe you're not reading that thing right let me see it no this is the place there's nothing here nate what a goddamn dead end easy sully just relax let's take a look around Probably gonna do. I'm gonna record these about a couple chapters at a time. Uh, see how that works. Oh, Obviously, man. first time this ever going like through with to it. So who fucking knows brothel. if I'm gonna finish it? Yeah. Dedication. <laughs> oh no! Oh, no. Can you guys get to watch me try to do puzzles? Oh. What do you think this is, Incan? Nah, it's older than that. Aiken. Like two thousand years older. Huh. Find anything? Nothing yet. Whoa. Be careful up there. 
Hey, there's something funny about the ground down there. There's something funny about the ground. It's a very descriptive term. It's hollow. We gotta find a way to smash through this. Is he recording any of this? Look what he just fucking destroyed. Oh my god. Welcome to Uncharted and an archaeologist playing it. That's basically what you're gonna hear this whole time. It's just me yelling that he destroyed everything. Is he recording it? Where where is his notes? Although he does have a field notebook, but mm, F minus for uh, attempt. Gonna need the flashlights for this one. Oh, oh, oh! Homey place, huh? <laughs> well, not quite what you were expecting, huh? Yeah. Where's all the damn gold? Yeah, this place was picked clean centuries ago. No good limey pirate. No, it wasn't Drake. <laughs> Check this out. Looks like the Spanish looter got here before he did. Another looter. <laughs> what the hell, Sully? Nate, I'm not looking for a lousy piece of tin. I'm up to my eyeballs in debt. Someone 600 years ago went really exploring an even thousand-year-old place. Oh, that's pretty cool. Too many big bar tabs in Lima, I guess. <laughs> that and, well, just a few bad deals. Yeah, well, I always told you to stay away from the bad guys. And the bad girls. Yeah? Look who's talking. What's that supposed to mean? That reporter? I saw the way you were eyeing her. Elena? Please. I snuffed any chance with her the second we ditched her on that dock. <laughs> All's fair in love and war, kid. Uh, and what if you can't tell the difference? Then, my friend, you are in big trouble. Those Spaniards sure left a lot of crap behind. Careful, Nate. That's quite a drop. You're not kidding. We gotta find a way across. What the hell are you giving me a gun? It has been quite a while since I've played this game, so it's basically like hey, playing it fresh. Hey, that looks like an old powder keg over there. Shut up! Don't, don't help me out. Ah, oh my work. god! The, oh my god! That hurts. Ugh! What a dick! Back into it. I'll hold it 
open. See if you can jam it from the other side. Nah, I think I'll take my time with it. All right, let go. This ought to hold it. Hurry, Sully! <laughs> that was a little too close. Just imagine if there was no way out after this. Door, huh? <laughs> They're just at they just fucking die in there. <sighs> well, this looks familiar. I think there's something in Drake's journal about this. Oh, that button. Yeah, here it is. Looks like this thing is some kind of lamp or brazier. See if you can light it. So, after all your bitching about the cigar, now it comes in handy, huh? Way to clear this debris. Nice. <laughs> Can you reload with this one? Okay. How the fuck do you reload? Do you not reload in this game? <gasps> okay, that's gonna be annoying. Now what? A little acrobatics. Oh no, that's the only thing I don't like about this game is that it like automatically shifts your camera angle. Okay. No! Fuck. <laughs> you jump up? Oh, yeah, you jump up. Uh, Nate! I might have been able to do that 30 years ago. So it would have been nice if, I don't know, maybe he fucking studied what culture this was and he could be saying like, oh, they built this structure in this such and such year. We literally know nothing in this story about who this group of people were, the culture that built this stuff, whose stuff that they're after, other than it's El Dorado and they can get big piles of money for it. We know absolutely nothing. And that the Spanish were here, built cool shit, but yeah, there's basically no cultural or historical background to it other than, ooh, shiny things. So, that kind of sucks. Shut up! Some friends, I can't throw bottle just in here. See what they got to say about it. Did he like pass me some fucking? What am I supposed to be clearing, my friend? You didn't hand me. You didn't hand me a match or anything, so I'm not sure how you're expecting me to do this. <gasps> what was your hint, old man? I was too busy talking. <laughs> I'm stuck. Oh, hey. Oh, no. Are you fucking me? There you go.
like fire wouldn't be able to make that work. Like, what do these skulls represent? Are we in like a burial chamber? Is this what we love to say ceremonial? I mean, there's definitely a lot of fucking bodies nightly packed into one area. What do you make of this? I don't know, Wait, Sully. Maybe we should have fucking researched this. The order of these signs has some importance. We got circle square, side face man, spider thingy, and Arissa. Uh, okay, what the fuck am I supposed to do with that? So. Circle square. Am I supposed to like put something on here? Uh, go to the next page. The order of these signs has some importance. Why would you write that in English? Okay. Am I supposed to put something on this? I'm not pushing you. You go second. Are you even the one that I need? No, you're third. Oh my god, just go the fuck up. There we go. Damn right, bitch. Science. Just kidding. This isn't science. Uh, and then I needed a uh, Spider Man. No, Two Face Man. Not Two Face Man. Side profile selfie man. And then Spooder Man. of you that have no idea what I'm talking about when I say Arisa. It's a character from Overwatch. It's an angry Arisa. Place. Deep. <sighs> yeah, looks like there's a ladder cutting to the side. Wait here while I check it out. All right, just be careful. You? Oh my God! Oh, I just got right down on it. Hey, watch your step down there. <laughs> what is the purpose? What does that open up into? So now we have uh, chains with skulls on them, which is that a Spanish thing or is that 
the culture that came here before, and this is part of it. Because would they have had iron? Everything around here is made of stone. And if it's thousands upon thousands of years old, they did not have metal then. So, who built the stains of chains? The t stains of chains? <laughs> what? <laughs> So they're meant to say that it was part of okay, get the somewhere. culture. Look at that water oh, physics. You're gonna swim in that. I've been in worse. Huh. Um, do I just drop in it? Oh, let's find out if I die. So like older cultures did have like copper and things like their metal wasn't unheard of being used but like iron and iron chain link uh, words are hard when I'm trying to concentrate on something else but yeah those mm, probably don't really match up with whatever culture they're trying to depict here if they're even trying to depict a culture. Apparently it's thousands of years before the Inca, because that can't be research. There can't be anything on Google that they could have just been like pre-Incan civilizations. Oh look, let's just fucking blow up. Look at that, like, you could study the shit out of that. That's someone's dissertation trying to figure out what that means, you know? Bye! Got this one. Do ya? Ah, this looks safe. God, you know how? Oh my gosh! Secondhand anxiety, just looking at that. Oh lordy me! And I'm fucking killed. <laughs> After that, we better be. Even the stones are decorated. They have, like, skulls on it. What is this building for? We never know. Oh, man. The temple must have been built around this. Around what? A statue. Gold statue. A huge gold statue. And look here, these people, they're worshipping the damn thing. At least, I think they're people. Of course. El Dorado, the golden man. Sully, it wasn't a city of gold. It was this. It was a golden idol. Man, can you imagine what that thing would be worth now? Look over here, tracks. Hmm. I bet the Spanish dragged it out on cut logs. <laughs> We're 400 years late for this party. So the trail's cold. Yeah, it looks that way. Son of a bitch. Unless... Unless what? We follow the tracks. finish up this chapter and then call it for now but look at that 
some pretty good fucking evidence. Although, that doesn't. What kind of what kind of architectural sense is that? Huh? They stop here. Yeah, it looks like the back wall of the temple was blown out. Yeah. Spaniards must have made themselves a shortcut to get the treasure out. Swell. Now what? There's no fucking way this was lost. <laughs> it's my one of my favorite inconsistencies about Uncharted is like, oh, it's a long lost city, especially when we get to the fourth one. Just no, it definitely would have been found by now. Wait, Sully, do you hear that? Look at how pretty. Now there's something you don't see every day. My God. during flood season and gotten stuck. <laughs> Let's check it out, huh? No, uh, wait, wait, wait. Something about this feels kind of hinky. Hinky? You act like you've never seen a German U-boat in the middle of the jungle before. Uh, I'm being serious, Nate. <laughs> I tell you what, why don't you stay here? I'll check it out myself. I'll call you if I run into any Nazis. Yeah, right. You do that. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Hold on to this for me, will you? Okay. Looks like I'm gonna have to do this the hard way. Alright. I will leave it there. I know it's not the end of the chapter, but I think it's a good ending point. Um, yeah. Oh, wait. There we go. I'm perfectly, perfectly timed. Okay. Um, well, I hope you enjoyed this first episode. Hopefully I keep doing them consistently and get better at <laughs> chatting. Uh, it's not usually my strong suit, but I like video games and I like archaeology, so there you go. Nice little shot to end it. Alright. Bye!